Hello and welcome to today's video. This one is going to be a little bit different than my normal videos. We are going to be decorating and reorganizing this bookcase. Um, I have some fall decorations that I want to put up on here just to kind of get in the spirit of the season. So I'm going to be rearranging this. There's a lot of books on here that I don't know if I want on my shelves anymore and so I think it's the perfect time to reorganize. I already reorganized my large shelf over here and then I realized I should have recorded it. It would have been a fun thing to do. So instead I'm going to record this one and then I'm also going to put some decorations up on the big shelf and I will show you guys and kind of take you along while I do that. So I think first things first is I need to just get everything off the shelf to start. Um, I will show you. It's a little mini shelf. It does have a lot of stuff up at the top. Um, and then um, this is mainly where I have my paperbacks, um, my romance books up here, some like YA graphic novels, and then I do have some more hardcovers down here at the bottom because I ran out of room. But some of this stuff is going to go in here. This is like a little mini closet. so. I'm gonna add some stuff in there. We're gonna take everything off of here and, and just reorganize it and make it look nicer. I don't think I like the book stacked up like this, so let's just get started. My camera, um, absolutely love photography and this is my film camera, it's a Canon AE-1 program in case you're wondering. I also have this roll that I need to take in and get this is a little fall doodle that I did the other day of just some of my uh, stuff that I have. This is my jacket I got this year, some fluffy socks I have, and then I bought, oh, I got these new boots. They're the LL Bean boots. But yeah, just some fun with the color pencils. I absolutely love this series. If you haven't read it, I would definitely recommend it. No, I have not watched the Netflix show yet, but I really love the graphic novel. like my only two like horror books that I have. These are Grady Hendrix. I actually just recently purchased um, the Final Girl support group because I like having them all in paperback. I bought this this one in paperback and then I decided all of my Grady Hendrix uh, books now have to be paperback so I end up getting them kind of a little bit later, like a year later because of the paperback releases but I'm okay with that. So I will be reading a new one by him. This is one of my favorite middle grade series. This is City... I think, well, it's the City of Ghosts. I don't know what the actual, like, title is. I think this is just, like, the Cassidy Blake, um, like, series. I did also buy... What is it called? Bridge of Souls, so you'll see that soon. Um, I've been picking up some books for a little spooky TBR, so... You will be seeing that video soon book sleeves. I keep them on the shelf. I'm not sure if I should. Um, some of these, like this one and this one, are from Happy Go Lovely Sleeves. These are my favorite because they have this extra pocket in the front so you can put like a notebook or, I don't know, tabs or anything if you're a tabber. I'm not. And then I also have these which were from another shelf. I just, they were really cute prints of like animals and stuff. So that's why I got them. And then this really cute Christmas one. I'm excited to use it for Christmas. Uh, these were from Owl Crate boxes back when I got those. I think I am going to keep them on the shelf. I don't think this shelf is really going to change too much. Um, just because I do, <laughs> I do need to store these books here. But I think it's the second two that 
we're gonna change up. This is the blue and red shelf for some reason. Everything is blue and red, blue and red, blue, blue and red. Um, and then my Crescent City. I haven't read these yet, but I do have both of them. I need to get on them. They're just so giant. I also really need to read A Court of Silver Flames. Um, I haven't gotten around to that one either. So I think we start with the romance. I want to keep it a rainbow shelf because I just prefer a rainbow shelf. This is one of my favorite romances. It's well met by Jen DeLuca. This is set at a renaissance fair, which I absolutely love a renaissance fair. I went to one in Maryland. This one is set in Maryland, so that was just a lot of fun. And I love the whole kind of culture and the feel of a renaissance fair. Even though I know it's not really very accurate, it's still so much fun to go to. And Mead is really, really good. This is another one of my favorite romance series. This is the Bromance Book Club. This also has another one coming out later this year that is Christmas related. It's called A Very Merry Bromance. But I'm also excited for that one. I really like this series. There's a couple that were not my favorite. But for the most part, I really enjoy it. So if you like guys reading romance novels, maybe check this one out. Um, it's basically the same book that I just put back up there but I knew this one was gonna kind of stay the same because I really like all of these and I want to keep them so nothing is getting taken down as of yet but it's the middle shelf that is going to be changing the most Okay, that is it for the reorganization. Now it's time to put the decorations on. I need to charge my battery though, so I'll see you guys a little bit later. Okay, my battery is charged and we are back. So now what I want to do is just kind of put some stuff up on the shelves. I don't have a lot of stuff, so this isn't going to be like extremely decorated, but I have a couple things. So just going to get these lights put up as well as have this garland that I want to put up and then I want to entwine these, this one, throughout these because this one um, lights up. So I think it would look really cute to have this draped. It's going to go over the top of this and then at night time I can turn it on and it will light up and I also have two more that will go up on top of the big bookcase and I think that's just gonna look really cute. I also have like some little decorations like this little guy who is ready for fall as well as some pumpkins that I'm going to put around. I do have some Halloween stuff but I think I'm gonna wait to put that up for now and I'm just going to kind of put up some fall stuff and then we'll see how it looks.
going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I decorated my shelves and just kind of reorganizing with me. And I think I'm going to try to get a few more decorations just to kind of spruce up the place. I also have some um, stuff hanging up there. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. Bye!